All right, well, another one of these. You know, I can't go any faster. I'm not fucking slowing down. I'm just not doing it. So how long is it going to take this one to pass me? He's been back there. he got a huge crowd of people building up. This has been going on for five miles. I don't know. I'm tired of these people. But I'm just going to sit here and mind my own business. I didn't ask for him to drive up there. I guess it's his business. He wants to be out there looking like a dickhead. Then go ahead and hang out there. Whatever. Perfectly flat ground. There's no reason to be to be sitting back there five miles. And you know, he's obviously he can. He's got what? Maybe a quarter mile per hour on me. <laughs> well, you know what? After another five, three or four minutes, move over. Or maybe just stay behind me. I mean, what a concept! Wow. Continue holding your foot on the pedal, maybe for like a 200 yards beyond me, and then you can move over. Would that work? Maybe. Oh, we're losing it. Oh, we just got—we just couldn't maintain it, could we? Now, well, that was once Consolidated Freightways, which was a really good Teamster outfit, and then the. Uh, Deregulation of uh, interstate. Uh, well, we'll give them a flash here. Go ahead and cut off my following distance. Make me look like I'm tailgating. Anyway, trucking was deregulated. Interstate trucking in 1980 by Jimmy Carter and company. And then uh, about 20 years later, 1981 Conwave. Central Western Express, whatever they call it, fires up Conway CF Company, and they start shifting their accounts over to the scab side. And about 20 years later, they turn the lights off on CF, and, and this is what we got now. Oh well, it only took five and a half, six miles, but he made it around me. 